thank you so much for for taking some time for us this morning. Uh, it, it's such a pleasure to get to visit with you. I'm very excited for everybody to see this new film that you're in. Um, it's it's really exciting. It's really thrilling, and I think audiences are just going to eat it up. Um, Jordan, can can we just start off and, and talk a little bit about your character in this film and kind of the journey? That, uh, that brought you to this character and kind of how you got involved with the project? Sure. Um, well, it was really simple. You know, it wasn't anything like super cool or anything. I um, got the audition um, sent to me by my agents. And, um, you know, I just, I read the script and I read the sides for it. And I was really, really interested in just playing a romantic interest for at some point in my life um so that was really cool and um I had the character's name is Harper uh and I just played a character uh whose name was also Harper kind of <laughs> um so it felt like it was kind of like fate or like destiny or something so I was like yeah you know obviously I'm gonna go out for it and um I want to say like a week or two weeks later I got the call back and was told that I got the job and I was like oh okay sick that's awesome <laughs> it's obviously meant to be so great <laughs> no you're right that, that that that's pretty straightforward I'm glad you didn't have yeah. to you know jump through <laughs> too many hoops or anything weird you know not this uh, time not this time yeah <laughs> well perfect perfect now uh, like I said, I'm really excited for audiences to to see this story and to to get to witness it. Um, it's really, really like edge of your seat, action, thrilling. You know, if, if folks like Twister, if they like Into the Storm, I really feel like they're going to be able to connect to Supercell. Yeah. Um, what to you is like the biggest moment in this film where you're just like yeah th this is going to bring audiences in this is what people are going to love and this is why it's probably going to be one of the next big storm features I mean I hate to sound like cliche but I mean all of the really storm scenes there's one scene in there where there's uh like obviously not the ending the ending is when the the big big guy comes in but yeah. there's one scene where um my co-star daniel his character is in a van and he's traveling and they're like going through like a mini storm kind of uh it gives the audience i think a really good uh taste of what's to come uh it keeps you on the edge of your seat like you said and um he just goes out and he's like in this dangerous storm and you're just like oh my god is he gonna die right now the movie just started what's gonna happen <laughs> type stuff but um it's very very compelling I think and um when I watched it at the premiere I was even though I knew what was gonna happen I was still on the edge of my seat like oh my god is he gonna be okay is he gonna survive <laughs> um yeah but to sound basic yeah all the storm scenes uh they're done very very well and I think us as a cast, we were able to really compel the, uh, really make it seem like we were like in some crazy storms, even though we weren't, uh, you know, we were in some really, really crazy storms. And I think you can see that on, on camera. So. Yeah, no, for sure. You guys really brought it to life. 110%. <laughs> we uh, tried, we tried. You know, speaking of Daniel and, and the rest of the cast, I, I really just wanted to ask you about your experience getting to work with these people because, uh, you know, you, you've got some really like top acting legends that, that are in this film with yeah. you. And, you know, it's it's honestly, it's just really a perfect blend of, you know, A-list actors who have done a little bit of everything. What what What's it like get, getting to work together with with all these these amazing actors and actresses dude I don't know how I keep getting so lucky to get with <laughs> these like top tier people and I'm just like yeah. um it's really cool it's a great experience um you know people uh would always I would always get super excited to you know meet the the a-list people you know the top tier um but you always get like nervous too uh you know you don't yeah they're your heroes or you know they're just people that you've always looked up to or watched or seen or whatever and you always hope that it always ends up 
being like a good relationship and they end up being really nice people. And thankfully I have been able to have that. Everyone has been super nice and super helpful and, you know, overall like really, really great people. It's a great experience. Um, Everyone's so welcoming and I'm still very new and young to the industry. So uh, people really have a, have a way of just taking me underneath their wing and just being like, hey, Jordan, let me show you the ropes. I'm like, okay, thank you. I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing. So it's a really, it's a great learning experience, I will definitely say. And I'm, I'm very, very appreciative. I don't know, genuinely, I don't know how I keep getting like casted in with these like amazing people. I'm just regular old me, but I will take it, obviously. <laughs> Great. No, I, I imagine that that just has to be absolutely thrilling, you know. It's great. It's so cool. Now, I, I like you said, you are you are a little bit newer to the industry, and I, I definitely want our our readers and our, and our watchers here to kind of give uh, or kind of understand a little bit more about your background, kind of how you found your way into into the industry and and kind of uh, your your beginnings, because uh, from what I understand, it's that you've had a really amazing like kick off to your acting career so far um kinda I would say so my mom says so so yeah I agree with her um yeah I started out my acting career I I mean I I didn't think I was going to be like a successful actor um I I did some acting at a, a youth theater called Fresh Visions Youth Theater in Philadelphia and um you know, it was just for funsies. It was just something to do after swim practice. Um, and my director there said that it was something that he thought I should pursue. And I was like, oh, I'm sure you say that to all the students, you know, it's whatever, whatever. And um, he, he, you know, he let me know he was being very serious. Um, so from that point on, uh, as I just, you know, went throughout the rest of my life, I eventually started, you know, applying myself to more acting things. And um, yeah, I just randomly got we are who we are, which is what most people know me from, uh, my breakout role, yeah. quote unquote. Um, and from that point on, it's been a very um, interesting ride. It's just been, you know, a lot of modeling things and commercials and blah, 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 all that stuff. It's It's been very interesting. I don't know how I got here. People ask me all the time, how'd you get here? I'm like, I have no idea. <laughs> I didn't plan for any of this, but I'm here and, you know, I'm really happy to be here. It's a like I said, it's a great learning experience and it's uh it's very, very interesting. I'm sure younger Jordan would be would think I'm very cool. So that's yeah. you know, that's the goal. <laughs> I'm trying to make young me think I'm cool. That's it. You know, if you could go back in time and give your younger self a high five. I mean, I, I, yeah. I have those moments all the time. Exactly. So. <laughs> <laughs> no, for sure. I, I definitely get it. And you know, obviously, I, I can't help but notice, but you've got a pretty awesome Bamax right behind Thank you. Thank you, yeah. Um, Bamax is probably one of my favorite Disney, you know, creations brought to life this century. So, yeah. uh, just wanted to showcase you, you're all right out. my book, 100%. <laughs> So, so we're buddies for life now, just because awesome. you, you got that Baymax, I knew instantly we were going to click. So, uh, I, <laughs> um, I, I definitely want to give everybody uh, a taste of what you've got coming up next. I'm sure you've got oh. some things that maybe you can let us know about, or at least maybe tease what, what, what's uh, going on. Mm, let's see. I mean, I, the things that I sh for sure, for sure can talk about are uh, personal projects of mine. I got a couple writing things, things that I'm I'm writing. I want to be a writer. No, Sweet. I don't. Well, I do. Maybe I'm starting on it. Don't do yeah. me. Um, <laughs> I'm, um, yeah, I'm definitely working on some scripts personally, like in-house. Um, so hopefully within the next few whatevers, you'll hear about them or something. I don't know. Sweet. Um, but um, yeah, all I have right now is Supercell. Everything else I can't talk about <laughs> legally. <laughs> Sorry. Um, Stay tuned to IMDb. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> just go on IMDb and, you know, just refresh every couple of weeks and you'll see something new eventually. And then I'll be able to talk about it. But yeah, I appreciate it. I appreciate you being so nice about it. Some people are like, come on, tell us. No, <laughs> I can't. I'm sorry. Yeah. Hey, no, I get it. Trust me. No, it's it's perfectly all right. I, I just <laughs> always like to to give everybody an opportunity if there's something they can talk about, but I, I totally get it if you can't. Like there's, I there's things in place. 
there's some you can look at out for me if you're in new york i know my uh kate spade um something is coming out and people are seeing me on billboards and stuff so oh. you, that that's something you could look out for it's nothing really special but i mean you might see me on a billboard in passing and be like oh i saw her you know whatever i don't know that's right get you heard it here first you can take <laughs> A picture of the billboard, a selfie the billboard. with yeah. the billboard of Jordan in New York. Pretend like it's I'm good. right there. It's great. It's <laughs> no, uh, that's awesome. And uh, I, I also want to make sure that people can connect with you. Is, is there a social media platform that you're more active on or a website where people can just uh, connect with you? The most? Um, yeah, the social media, the easiest one that I'm on or the one that I'm on the most is probably Instagram. I don't understand Facebook, if I'm being honest, um, but I do have one, but I just don't understand it. Um, so I don't go on it that much. Um, and I'm every once in a while, I'll um, have like a identity crisis and I'll go on TikTok. So my, <laughs> I guess I sometimes don't understand that one either. Um, but my, my username is my full name, Jordan Simone, on both of those. Um, and I, I love interacting with people. I love talking to people. I don't consider myself a celebrity or anything. I'm a normal person that is verified for some reason. So, you know, please talk to me. I'd love to talk to you. I'd love to have some conversations or whatever, you know, all open. I'm very open. All right. Fantastic. Uh, well, Jordan, is there any, you know, final words you'd like to share, share with everybody uh, regarding Supercell? Um, thank you. Thank you so much for taking the time to talk to me. I really appreciate it. And um, I hope you guys like the movie. It's coming out March 17th, I want to say. Yeah, that's the correct date. Something around there. It's coming out soon. Look out for it. Um, it's going to be in theaters soon. And I, I hope you guys enjoy. Um, I had a great time shooting and all that good stuff. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the movie. It's good. Go see it if you have time. I mean, if you don't, it's totally fine. But like, if you have time, please go see it. I'd really appreciate it. <laughs> awesome. Thank you, Jordan. It, it's been an absolute pleasure getting to visit Thank with you. you this morning. Thank you so much for taking time for us. Absolutely. Um, and, you know, I, I wish you the best of luck in all, all your future endeavors. Uh, you're going to be amazing. Like, I, I can already, I, I'm pretty good at, at putting this stuff yeah. out there in the world. And, <laughs> and it getting verified down the road. So <laughs> I, I've got a good feeling about you and your career. And I, I really can't wait to see uh, some of those writing projects you're working on. Thank you. Thank you. You were so sweet. This is so fun. Thank you so much. <laughs> no, it's my, it, seriously, it's my pleasure. I, I'm, I'm so excited that I got to talk to you this morning and, and get to share some of your story with, uh, with our readers, our community. So thank you so much for having me and allowing me this opportunity. Absolutely. Thank you. 